All right, guys. So first thing you're gonna do is get a capo. Put on your first frets. Can't play the song without a capo. All right, next thing, we're gonna learn the drum beat. So I'm gonna post it right up here. Okay, so you're gonna to wanna to write that down. So I'll play it pretty slow, and I'll play it a bit faster so you can get the general gist of it. Here is it slow. Here's a normal hevel. Alright, to get that down, I have one more drum beat for you. This is the drum beat we use once we start playing chords, and I'll post it on the screen right now. Alright, so here's the second drum beat. This one's a bit simpler, it's just basically the beginning of the old one. So here's the first chord. Here's the second. And here's the third. We're also going to use a F and a G. If you don't know how to play those, I would recommend not playing the song. But if you just forgot, here it is. This is the F. So you're going to play. Second on the G, first on the E, and a G, probably the second most common you play the chord. You're just going to play second on the C, third on the E, second on the A, and open on the top string. Alright, so now you know the chords. Like again, you can write it down, it'd be easier. Now we're gonna play them. Okay. So this is how it goes you have your first chord. Now you have this. So you're gonna go up, and you're gonna hit the seven. Then play the chord again. up to the five on the top string. So all you're playing is it's pretty much the basic shape for the entire song. So with the drum beat and stuff it's gonna be a bit challenging. But let's look at the other chord. So now you have go down to here. So you're going to do the same thing. You're going to have to stretch your fingers a bit. So you're going to hit the chord. Five, zero, five, seven. All in the A string. It's a bit stretching. Okay. Now you're going to play this A. Or you're just gonna beat the string up the floor. So this is a bit challenging. But you can hear the string's muted. But these things ring. Alright. So now you're gonna hit the five up the floor. So on this you're not gonna hit the zero. You're just gonna keep strumming the chord. Then five, and then up to seven. So in total, you have five, and back up. So that's pretty much the entire thing. And then you know you just have your G and your your F and your G, but that comes later. All right. So if you are on the first drum beat. I'm gonna do that about two to four times, it really depends if you're singing or not. Then you get to your chord. So you're gonna play your chord. 
but with the drum beat. The second drum beat though. So. snare when you're hitting the body you're gonna hit the seven yeah. then when you go on the downstroke after the snare you're gonna let go of your seven and hit the hit the open chord again okay now we're gonna do that same thing, but except on the snare, you hit the 5 on the D, on the A, I mean, hit the 5, then on the downstroke, you're going to hit the 7, so 5 snare, 7 down. So in total, you have... So now, when we get to the second chord now, we're going to hit five, like I just did. Okay, so I'm going to start off your drum beat. On the snare, you're going to hit the five, and then on downstroke, back to open chord. Snare, open, then you're going to keep going. Then snare, downstroke seven. That's how you do that one. Okay, now we're gonna get to third chord. You're gonna do the drum beat. All right, so now we're gonna add the stuff. So this one, first you're gonna go, you're gonna hit the five with your pinky. And then now stroke open chord again. So. and then go up to your seventh but you're gonna let go of the chord because that's a hard reach then you're gonna reset so then you're gonna do it again so in total I'll play it slow it's gonna sound like this parts of the song uh, you know that just kind of repeats over then you get to the F and you get to your G so that part all you're doing is it's holding it down and you're gonna do the first first drum beat so it's gonna go then you switch again then you just go back so yeah that's pretty much it and then it goes for a pause where you're just hitting the drums I didn't include that in my video but that's part of it and you just go back Uh, just follow along to a Musical Miles video to get the full song. I didn't do the full song. Um, but follow along, you can get the full thing. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.